this is the tree um, as far as we uh, went during the last course um, be sure that you open up the hierarchy and then choose file merge and load the leaf object into the scene uh, that we created in the leaf tutorial it should show up in the objects list I'll rename it to leaf and then simply drag this leaf object um, into the third position of the branch 3 hierarchy right here so here we go we just have to fine-tune some of the parameters of branch 3 at first I don't like um, the angle in which the leaves emerge from the branch so activate branch 3 go for the node properties and take a look at the node angle parameter um, drag the left control points uh, downwards to about 70 uh, degrees and uh, the rightmost control point down to about 45 degrees this already looks much better and well I want uh, to make this a really gnarly old tree where uh, we only have some thing leaves in the outer areas of the um, 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 yeah of the branches um, so I'll use the distribution parameter to concentrate the leaves in the outer area of branch 3 you have to use a control curve similar to this and to intensify the effect I'll shorten um, the length of the branch so go for translation Y activate the leftmost control point and use values around 150 units, units yes I think this is this is pretty nice of course this is not super realistic because when you take a look at the size of the leaves uh, you'll notice that they are too big compared to the stem and um, to the branches um, so if you want to go for more a realistic appearance uh, you should um, perhaps add one more branching level um, and also use smaller leaves or you could use uh, another bitmap uh, which not only contains one leaf but um, well a cluster of leaves or a complete branching level the next step will show you how to create a nice rough surface because until now you can see um, that uh, the trunk is uh, pretty smooth and uh, during the next steps we'll change this a little bit